I'm Paran. I'm a street artist from uh, Spain, from the Canary Islands, and I'm now based in uh, Stoke Newton, so I'm a, an East London-based street artist. Sometimes I'm inspired by nature, but uh, you will think, oh well, but you're not painting nature that much, but I'm imagining women in nature, how they interact in nature. I'm inspired by anatomy. I did a lot of anatomy work and uh, life drawing lessons, and I think that helped me to draw bodies and proportions. And uh, of course, it's all a learning process because the bigger you draw, the um, I would say like the proportions are different and they are a little bit more difficult. But I think my inspirations are life drawing, anatomy. I love painting hands, and when I see. Uh, people, especially women, doing uh, certain poses with their hands. I like either taking photos of them or even I'm watching a film and sometimes I, I see a scene or an actress does something that I liked and I try to sketch it very quickly. I do a lot of urban sketches too. Not many people know about how I got into street art, but I was a street art um, fan. I love art. I studied on my own a little bit of art, history of art, um, drawing, sketching, everything. But then when I came to London, I started to see the street art, especially Banksy, and I was a big fan of Banksy. I started to do stencils as well. And um, this is mostly what he got me into street art. Here in the street, people, they really appreciate it more because it's a way of beautifying the street. I intend people to feel different things when they look at my work. It's mostly about women, so the message is about equality, it's about women, we can do things, we can climb up on a ladder, we can paint, we can spend hours and hours like with this space. And um, it's, a, it's a little bit of a self-realization process as well. So I want people to understand that um, and also about love, especially this piece is about love to, to our community, to Stoke Newton and uh, Jelly and me we do this piece um, mostly every year and we're trying to, to show our appreciation to the community and, um, but sometimes it's about environment, I do pieces about war but mostly from a feminine and female point of view. They always have some sort of, um, something like um, imaginary, some fantasy. Most of the time they have a positive message, but sometimes I'm a little bit critical, but it's mostly based on female um, women. <laughs> it's about women. <laughs>